Hi! Um, a lot of people sometimes ask me what are the things that I miss about Germany and what are the things that I don't miss about Germany and I just thought I'd just make videos about that and I'm going to start with the things that I do not miss about Germany. A uh, little backstory, I'm German, which most people will know that watch these videos but if this is the first one you watch, I'm German, I came to the UK in 2011 and I've been living here ever since, I live in London. I've only ever lived in London, so all my opinions are probably based on a bit of a London opinion, so I'm sorry about that. But let's get into the video. The first thing that I definitely do not miss about Germany is just rudeness. I can't really put it any other way. Um, this is obviously not to say that everyone in Germany is rude or that it's like a thing that Germans are rude, but I can't deny the fact that every time I come to Germany I do notice that people are less friendly. That's the only way I can say it. Um, in London, even though people are always in a rush, and you do get rude people here too of course, but generally if you have luggage and you're walking downstairs there's at least two people that will offer to help you. If you bump into someone it's almost like a competition of who excuses the other one more like excuse me oh, I'm sorry like oh or if you like walk down an escalator and someone else wants to walk down as well you'll be like oh no you go first no you go first no you go first it's like just overly friendly overly polite whereas in Germany especially on transport I noticed this about three weeks ago when I was on a bus in Germany everyone just pushed and was really grumpy and like Everyone just had an attitude and it was something that I really wasn't used to because, no. Also I went to a gig a few weeks ago in Germany and no, it was just not nice. It's just something I'm really not used to because everyone in the music business, especially in England that I've met so far, is just overly friendly, overly helpful. Whereas when I went to the gig in Hamburg, I was shocked to find that even the people working at the venue were just, were just rude and just... Yeah, I was not impressed with that. So yeah, rudeness is something I definitely do not miss about Germany. Uh, I think it has to do with the people just being more pragmatic, being more, you know, open and more willing to express their grumpy mood. Whereas in England, it feels like people are more likely to hide it and pretend they're happy, which, you know, you can see whatever way you want. But to me, it's definitely nicer to be in England. <laughs> The second thing that I definitely do not miss about Germany is just the way people write emails, the people write letters, just the way you talk to like institutions or doctors or anything like that. I Every time I get an email from like my German doctor or anything, it's just so, it's so hard work because they, um, they use formal you and they'll be like, dearest, honourable patient following up our call from Saturday the 16th of last month I would like to inform you about like it's just such weird language it just takes so long to read it takes forever to like write back and you can't just be like hi Mr. Blah I'm really you know you can't just informally reply you have to do the whole spiel about just make really long sentences and it's just super complicated nothing is ever easy there nothing is ever easy if you call anyone they're like oh yeah you have to call them and them it's just so hard whereas in England I feel it's acceptable to text your doctor it's acceptable to call them and be like hi there I need an appointment tomorrow is that cool yeah cool bye that's fine in Germany would be like um hi yeah this is um, Miss Dreyer um, I would uh, kindly ask you to uh, book me in for a um, an appointment possibly next week from um, 800 hours like it's just crazy I, I, I absolutely do not miss that I absolutely love being informal with my boss with everyone I just I think it's the best thing ever and I do not understand why Germany is so far behind in that and why everyone has to talk like they're like in a Shakespearean play I d yeah it does my head in nowadays <laughs> Another thing I don't miss about Germany is probably really weird, but it's actually speaking German. I I love German, you know, I love reading German. I, I don't mind watching German TV or German movies, but I, I myself have issues almost speaking German because German is a very 
detailed, very to the point language almost, like everything you say is really specific. So English to me feels like a more broad language. Like when someone says something, you can interpret what they say almost because there just isn't as many words to describe it. That's how I feel anyway. Um, whereas in German, everything you, you say, it's almost like really to the point and you, yeah. I, I, it's a weird one. I, I, to be, it's just me personally. I don't miss speaking German, and I prefer not to speak German. Even if I meet German tourists in London that ask me for directions, I will usually not disclose that I'm German, and I'll usually reply to them in English, which is probably a bit mean. But I just can't bring myself to do it, to be honest. And the fourth and last thing that I could think of that I don't miss about Germany is German food. Um, there is a lot of things in German cuisine that are nice. Um, I'm, I've never been a fan of it. I don't like sauerkraut I obviously don't like any of the meat dishes because I'm a vegetarian slash trying to be vegan whatever and yeah German cuisine is just very it's not my thing I don't miss it the only thing I miss is German bread but that will be in my video about what I do miss about Germany um, but otherwise there isn't much that I miss um, I can't really say that I prefer the British or English cuisine because that's not my cup of tea either but I, I can still say that I don't miss the German cuisine because it's not that good really so yeah that's four things that I, I don't miss about Germany I hope you enjoyed this video if you're someone who emigrated Germany and you want to share what you do not miss about Germany feel free to link it below or just comment whatever let's get some conversation going and yeah see you in my next video bye guys